Welcome to Communication Engineering Playlist. Here in this session, I'll be going to solve examples based on frequency modulation. So let us begin with first example. When modulation, modulating frequency of FM is given by 400 hertz. So here, FM that is given, that is 400 hertz. And modulating voltage, that is 2.4 voltage. So EM that is given by 2.4 voltage and modulation index is 60. So MF that is 60. Calculate maximum deviation. So based on this we can easily calculate maximum deviation and that we can calculate by modulation index that is delta F by FM. So we can say maximum deviation that is MF into FM and here modulation index is 60, FM is 400, so 6 into 4, 24 into triple zero means kilo hertz. Now from this even we can calculate frequency sensitivity and frequency sensitivity that we can identify by delta F is equals to KF EM. So, that frequency sensitivity that will be Kf is equals to delta F pi Em where delta F is 24 kilohertz and Em for this case that is 2.4 voltage. So, we can say this is 10 kilohertz per voltage. So, this is what frequency sensitivity. Now, in this question, what is the modulation index when modulating frequency is reduced to 250 hertz and modulating voltage <coughs> is simultaneously raised to 3.2 voltage. So, now we are changing data where now new data that is given by Fm is equals to 250 hertz and em that have raised to 3.2 voltage. So now based on that first we can identify delta f that is kf into em. kf that is what 10 kilohertz per volt into em that is 3.2 voltage. So this voltage voltage will get cancelled 3.2 into 10 that is 32 kilohertz so new deviation that is 32 hertz and based on that new modulation index mf that is delta f by fm where delta f is 32 kilohertz divided by fm that is 250 hertz. So this will result into modulation index. If you calculate this, you will be finding it is 128. So modulation index that is 128 for new case. Now let us solve next problem where over here in this problem in FM system audio frequency is 1 kilohertz. So here audio frequency FM that is 1 kilohertz that is given. Audio voltage is 2 voltage. So here EM that is 2 voltage. The deviation is 4 kilohertz. So delta F that is 4 kilohertz. If AF voltage is now increased to 8 voltage and its frequency dropped to 500 hertz. So let us say this is 1, this is for case 1 and we have second case where voltage EM2 that is 8 voltage and frequency FM2 that is 500 hertz. Find the modulation index in each case and corresponding bandwidth using Carson's rule. 
So for both of the case, we are calculate we are delivered to calculate modulation index as well as bandwidth. Now for first case, we have delta F one, that is sensitivity into E M one. So this will result into frequency sensitivity, and frequency sensitivity is delta F one divided by E M one. Delta F one that is four kilohertz. By E M one that is two voltage, so we can say this is two kilohertz per volt. So frequency sensitivity is two kilohertz per volt in first case. Now we can calculate delta F two of second case. Let's see delta F two for second case that is. Kf into Em two. So this is where we can use this frequency sensitivity. So this is two kilohertz per volt into Em two. So that is eight over here. So deviation is sixteen kilohertz over here. Now modulation index for second and first case has same formula. Mf that is for first case let us Mf one that is delta F one divided by Fm one so delta F one that is two kilohertz sorry delta F one that is four kilohertz and Fm one that is one kilohertz so this is one for first case sorry four for first case. And for second case, M F two, that is delta F two, divided by F M one, F M two, sorry. So delta F two, that is sixteen, and kilohertz. Then F M two, that is five hundred hertz, means zero point five. So it is thirty two for second case. So modulation index is thirty two for second case. Now bandwidth as per Carson's rule. So let us say bandwidth one. So that is two into delta F one plus F M one. So if you place values two into delta F one, so that is four kilohertz and F M F one that is one kilohertz. So four plus one five into two ten kilohertz. And bandwidth for second case. That is. Two into delta F two plus F M two as per Carson's rule, so this will be two into delta F two that is sixteen, and F M two that is five hundred hertz means it is zero point five, so sixteen point five into two that is thirty three kilohertz. So that is how we can solve this problem.